Hi guys, right now we are going to Lush. Bill was actually here the other day getting some birthday surprises for me. Yeah, they do. And you said they had some good stuff, right? Oh yeah, they had their Christmas stuff out already, I think. Look at the pretty pink pumpkins. Hi. I like the orange one too. This is one of the bath bombs that Bill got for me. Isn't this cute? Have you used that one? No, yeah. he just bought me one for my birthday. This is another one that Bill bought for me for my birthday. It's a snowman bubble bar. This one is so cute. I'm gonna hate to even use it because it's so adorable. Sometimes I get some of them and I hate to even use them because they're just, whoa, that's about to fall off the stick. That would not be good. This one is so pretty. The magic wand. Oh my goodness. I want one of everything. I'll take one of everything in here, please. <laughs> Okay. Is it, why does that in some way remind me of like a Spongebob character? Is that weird? The bright side bubble bar. That one looks cool. It reminds me of candy corn. Oh, okay. Citrus. Where's the ghost on this one? Oh, there it is. I love this little ghost one. I can't wait to use that. I did decide to get one of the monsters because I always see the monster ball one and think it's so cute, so I decided to get one. Hi guys, right now I am filming in my office because basically the lighting is horrible today. It's been raining out for the past three days, so the lighting is just absolutely terrible and this room currently has the best lighting. I have my fireplace video going in the background just to make it feel a little bit cozier. Since I took you guys shopping with us at Lush, I thought I would also include a haul in this video because in my last video I asked if you guys would like to see hauls at the end of my shopping vlogs and all of you said yes. Let's start with this one back here and oh my gosh you guys, my office smells so good right now. You know how when you walk into a Lush store and it smells amazing? That is how my office smells right now. So the first one that I got, I'm going to have to look these up too. The first one that I have here is called the Plum Snow, and this is a bubble bar, and this one is supposed to have sweet, fruity bubbles. And this one definitely smells sweet. I love this one, and I also think this one is so pretty. I believe this is part of their Christmas collection. This one is called the Lush Luxury Pud, and this one is a bath bomb. I think I also had one of these last year, and I absolutely loved it. And this one, let's see, I actually have the website pulled up because I have no idea of the names or the scents of these, and I am terrible at describing scents. They all smell amazing to me. So this one is supposed to smell of lavender, and it is supposed to banish tension and aid relaxation. Next I picked up the Sugar Plum Fairy Lip Scrub. This is my first time ever buying this. I thought this smelled amazing and I also thought the color was really pretty. So this one is supposed to scrub lips soft with the fruity taste of black currants and supposedly you're supposed to be able to just scrub your lips with this stuff and then lick it off when you're done. You can just eat this because it is edible. I'm definitely excited to try this out because in the winter time my lips get so dry and chapped so I'm hoping that this stuff will work good. Next I have another bath bomb and these are making a mess all over my desk. I thought this one was so adorable. This one is called the Monster's Ball. On the Lush website this one is described as a scent of fruity lime and this one claims to be the most beautiful bath ever so I'm super excited to try this guy out. Let's see what else it says. 
It says, this Cyclops's outer layer creates swirls of pink froth on top of deep blue purple water. So that one sounds very pretty. Like I said, I am definitely excited to try this one out as well as the others. This cute little guy here is also a bath bomb and he is called the Butter Bear Bath Bomb. And this one is supposed to smell like sweet vanilla, which I love vanilla scents. So again, definitely excited to try this one out. And let's see what it says about him on their website. It says, this friendly critter has a generous helping of cocoa butter to give you the softest bear hug imaginable. Ooh. It's great for nourishing and protecting skin no matter how long you bathe. So this is another great one for the winter months, maybe when your skin is starting to get a bit dry. He is so adorable. These next ones are the ones that Bill surprised me with for my birthday and you guys, he did so good. I always love getting Lush for gifts. So first of all, I love this one because it is Halloween themed and you guys know how much I love Halloween. So this one is called the Ectoplasm and this is a jelly bomb, which I don't know if this is the first time they've ever had these. This is my first one, so I am really excited to use this. I've probably said that a million times in this video that I'm excited to use all of these, so I apologize for that. So let's read and see what it says about this one. This one says, for a truly otherworldly experience this fall, drop this bomb in your tub and watch it ooze a layer of supernatural jelly on top of your water. And the picture on their website looks so cool. I'm gonna insert a little picture here because it looks amazing. And then it also says, this slippery stuff isn't just for show though, it's made from nutritious skin softening seaweed. So you'll emerge from your soak spookily silky. Immerse yourself in this invention to be haunted by its zesty tangerine and grapefruit perfume. If you guys have tried this one out, leave me a comment down below. Like I said, I've never tried one of these jelly bombs. He also got me this adorable guy here, and I think this is probably one of the cutest things that I've ever gotten from Lush, and I'm going to have such a hard time using this one because he is just so cute. And this one is a bubble bar, wait, actually on their website it says it's a bubble rune, which to be honest, I have no idea what that is. If you guys know what the difference between a bubble bar or a bubble rune is, leave me a comment down below. But basically I think it does the same thing, it makes bubbles in the water. So let's see what it says about him. It says, bubbles have never felt so soft with fair trade organic cocoa and shea butter packed into this bubble rune. Along with the citrusy combo of organic lemon myrtle and Sicilian lemon oils to give you a bath time boost. Complete with a touch of calming Cyrex oil, the snowman will quickly become a Christmas time chum. The last one that I have to show you is another bubble bar, and this one is called the Pink Pumpkin. I mean, come on, what else would this be called? Unless maybe they called it the Amazing Pink Sparkly Pumpkin. That could also work. Bill did such a good job picking these out, you guys. Again, I think I'm going to have a hard time using this one. Do you guys ever get products from Lush and then you hate to use them because they're so pretty, you just kind of want to keep them forever and have them for display? On their website, this one says, Halloween doesn't have to be all about ghouls and monsters. This bright pink bubbler is perfect for those who might be more inclined to dress up as a unicorn than a zombie. Fall in love with an enchanting bouquet of geranium, bergamot, and jasmine as your bath fills up with swirling plastic-free pink shimmer and heaps of fluffy foam. This one sounds amazing. Alright guys, that is going to be it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. Also be sure to check out my last video. I did a little shopping for some Christmas decor. I am getting so excited for Christmas every time I go to a store. I swear they're putting out their Christmas decorations or they already have all of them out. So definitely be sure to check out that video. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you all have a wonderful day and I will talk to you in my next video.